Right guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. In this one, I'm just going to be addressing uh, an issue that people have with the Shimano hydraulic shift levers, that is the Altegra and the Durace. This doesn't apply to the 105 or the Tiagra hydraulic brakes. Um, and that is the free stroke adjustment and what it is actually doing. So I'll go ahead, let's get stuck into it. Right, so here we have the lever. This just happens to be a Durace R9120 hydraulic brake lever. Now, if you've never touched your levers, say if you fitted them or you bought a brand new bike that's got them on, and this applies to the Altegra R8020, say, those levers as long as they're hydraulic brake. So if you've just got a bike and it's got those fitted, or you've just fitted them yourself. Now, if you just get your hand and just go like that, as you can see there, all that movement there that's doing nothing, so you can get rid of that. So what you want to do, this applies to all the all Tigra, like I said, and the Dura Race. Pull back your hood, right back. If you see just there, the silver screw there two millimeter hex head do is locate that just turn it anti-clockwise like so and just keep checking that still a little bit there let's go a little bit more there you go totally solid that's just got rid of all that movement, wasn't doing anything. Same applies to the other side as well, you can do that. So, that's just got rid of a load of movement. And then, if you've got these levers and you're on the drops, and you can't reach very easily, the actual lever, do is 2 mil hex head again, and just go up inside up inside there, there's a two millimeter there. So if you just turn that, like so, it just shortens that there. It doesn't go very far in a few turns. And if you turn it back again, it winds it out. So as soon as it stops moving, you can stop turning it, like that. So I hope you found the video helpful, if you did remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more cycle related content, till next one ride safe and I'll see you then.